Where are you folks from? Brookfield. Brookfield, okay. So this is your first time at the fair or not? Oh no, every year we come. Oh great. I don't know how many years. So we moved here in 1988, so probably since 90. Terrific. What do you like best about it? All the people who So you're, you're the beekeeper? Yeah, I'm the beekeeper. Well, that's terrific. How many years have you been coming to the Apple Country Fair? Uh, probably, probably at least 20 if not oh, more. Not. Old colony of bees here, is that yeah, what this observation is? Observation hive. Yeah. You've got the workers and then the, you got the queen is in there too. I got a, a red mark on it so the kids and people will find it. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Zoom in a little bit there. <laughs> yeah. Everybody's always wants to know where the queen is. Is uh, beekeeping becoming more popular lately? Yeah, it seems to be a lot more popular now since they, you know, there's all the talk about a colony collapse disorder on TV and stuff. So it seems like more people are getting into it, which is a good thing. Is this your own collection here? Uh, these two right here. The farm alls? Yep, the farm alls. So is this part of a club or something? No, these are, this, this is uh, my sister and brother-in-law own these two and uh, uh, the two farm alls are ours. We just, uh, Ken Cleveland knew I had tractors and asked a couple of years ago if we'd come down and uh, participate, uh, you know, a little something different for uh, uh, the town and the uh, uh, Apple Country Fair. This started by Brookfield Agriculture Commission. Terrific. We started out with 12 farms. We now represent 195 farms in Central Mass. Hey, Brookfield, you guys want to sign this? Sure. Yeah.
all the baked goods. Pretty much down to a few things. Wow. And, uh, we've had a great day. Perfect. So, have they have they had the pie judging contest and all that? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's yeah. done. We sold all the we one, piece one piece of pie left. Ah. That was that's it. Yeah. <laughs> it's delicious. Where are you from? From North Brookfield. Okay, is this your first Apple Country Fair here this in Brookfield? This is the first time I've been here, yes. Oh, what do you think? I think it's very nice. I think uh, it's a beautiful day. Everybody needs to get out. Sturbridge, okay. Is this your first time at the Brookfield Apple Country Fair? It is, yeah. It is. What do you think? I love it. Great yeah, vendor. Great. What do you think? What do you like most? What are you looking for? That's fry, the French fries. <laughs> <laughs> But we got this and we really like that. There's so many different uh, spots with different varieties of things, some nice music and tasty foods. What do you like best about it? Uh, my sister's stand. <laughs> she has the best jellies, pickles, and relishes. She makes them. Oh, I was like, ten dollars. Thank you so much. I know. I know. It's a seventy-two percent support scout. So this is over behind the elementary school now. Yep. Right. So we started back here, school parking lot. It was an old Eagle Scout project. Um, they that they did as the service project 40 years ago. So we went up this trail, um, cutting all overgrown stuff. One team did this. We met up like right here, about right here. This has, this is a high area where you, you get a great view of the railroad and some of the Quaybog River. This is a stone wall border. Over the stone wall, we had to carve an entirely new trail because it was too overgrown and there's no more like old trail markers to point the way. So. Um, yeah, we just got our funding for the signs in. This is one of the introductory signs that we, you will be seeing on the um, trail. Nice to meet you. Okay. Is he a guide dog in training? I am his puppy raiser for the oh. Pinocchio Guide Dog Foundation. Okay. I've had him since uh, the Friday of last Labor Day weekend. And he's being called in for proper training. Uh, wow. Where's your organization out of? Fidelco is in Bloomfield, Connecticut. Okay. And they're the only guide organization in New England or really in the country that does what they call in community service, where they will go to wherever the client lives, the trainer and the dog, and work with that person until it clicks to be up to a month. And it's a nonprofit organization, so it's free of charge to the client. And we're in the United States of America. Okay, so where are you from? I'm from Lowell, Massachusetts. Oh, okay. So this is your first time at our Apple Country Fair here in Brooklyn? It's not. I haven't been here in a few years, um, but we used to come all the time with my family. All right. Yep. What do you like best about it? I just really like the whole fall feel of everything in the community. 